Amazon and Microsoft, these two companies will ask you one graph question at least in one of the rounds, right? Sometimes at Amazon, they end up asking graph questions in each of the rounds. So as you can understand, the graph is a very, very important topic, right? So the very common topics in graphs are BFS, DFS, Dijkstra's algorithm, topological sort, so uh, union find, right? And I've covered all of these topics, uh, barring a few, in my graph lady series. And I'm going to cover all the uh, remaining topics like topological sorting and a couple of other problems based on miscellaneous uh, topics, right? On my graph lady series very, very soon, right? So if you haven't checked out my graph lady series, do go and check it out, right? I have covered extensively on Dijkstra's algorithm, how Dijkstra's algorithm came into being, what is the intuition behind Dijkstra's algorithm? Because many people understand what Dijkstra's algorithm is, right? But they don't understand how this algorithm came into place because that will actually help you to solve problems right i think i talked about dial's algorithm i talked about bfs right and then i went into dijkstra's right i also talked about two approaches using priority two and three set many very very few people talk about three set in their tutorials right so again that is a very good way of impressing an interviewer also also i have uh, explained in, in detail about union find i have an extensive one hour video on union find where you understand that how union find comes into being right and i've explained a lot of problems amazon microsoft google problems on union find so do go and check out my graph playlist uh, series right I, I will attach the link down in the description right and watch the videos from scratch I'm working on the other videos topological sort will be released very soon a couple of videos I'm working on that right and also just to check that what is your current preparation on graph right here is something that I've, I've brought up to you guys so I discussed with a couple of couple of you know uh, platforms right so that I could host a mock uh, a mock coding round specifically on graph so that you can test out your skills on graph because as i said graph is a very very important topic in all of the major product based companies whether be it online coding round or be it your coding interview rounds you just cannot live without graphs you cannot survive without graphs right even i've seen a lot of companies not focusing on dynamic programming like you might get away with dynamic programming though i won't recommend you to do that because dp is a very very important topic and still ask a lot of companies like google right but draft is such an elementary topic that every company prefers to ask right so that is the reason i thought that okay i have taught you graphs right i've taught i've had already 15 16 odd videos on graphs but how will you understand whether you are grasping the concepts? Where do you exactly stand? Where, what are the problems that you are facing, right? So I wanted to understand all these things so that I can plan out my videos better. So let's say when I complete my graph series, I at least finish the basic topics and the basic problems, I can understand where you guys lack and maybe I can take some live sessions or maybe I can put up some more videos focusing on the topics where you're lacking, right? So I have till now as I record this video, I have, you know, covered uh, like Dijkstra, BFS, all types of BFS, DFS, Union Find, right? I haven't covered topological sorting yet or bipartite graphs and all these things yet. So I am going to test out only on those topics that I've taught so far. That is Union Find, that is BFS, multi-source BFS, uh, different varieties of BFS problems, right? DFS problems, uh, like Dijkstra's algorithm, various varieties of Dijkstra's algorithm, right? So all these things I'm going to focus on and that is why I have come up with a specialized graph contest, a graph mock contest, specially for you guys. And now we'll walk through the contest so that you can understand what exactly you need to do. And don't worry, there are some prizes for this contest as well to make things even better for you and, things, and to make things more exciting. The top five winners will have some surprise gifts right from my side. So don't worry and let's check it out that uh, like, uh, what 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 is this contest all about and when how exactly you can give it how you can register for this context and when is the context so now let's dive down uh, and let's understand this I'm just it's my honest interviewer to help you guys prepare to motivate you guys uh, you know to prepare so don't forget to like this video and also subscribe to my channel I'm, all, I'm trying a lot to help you guys in this process uh, I'm trying out a lot of tutorial videos you can also see my builder pattern LED uh, series as well uh, trying different uh, sort of things that can add value to your preparation journey, right? So if you feel I'm adding some value, uh, please support me by pressing the like button, by subscribing to my channel, by pressing the bell icon. And if you have any doubts, you can always reach out to me on Instagram. You can definitely follow me over there. I am super active over there, right? You can personally connect with me. And also don't forget to join my Telegram group, which is a sort of a personal community where I talk to you guys who understand what are the problems you're facing. And most importantly, I post hiring updates over there. So now let's jump into the details of this graph 
voting contest. Okay, guys. Uh, so as you can see, uh, this is the draft contest. So already, as I record, 67 people have registered. So do go and uh, register for this contest. It's completely of you don't have to pay anything. So it is going to be hosted on Code Studio, uh, powered by Coding Ninjas. So as I said, I talked to a couple of platforms. So I'm very thankful to Coding Ninjas uh, for agreeing to my request, right, and allowing me to conduct this mock uh, draft contest for you guys. Right, so I handpicked some of the questions, right? And this contest, uh, as I said, it's free and anyone can you know participate. And it's it starts on you know 24th of May, that is I think on Tuesday, right? Next Tuesday, and it starts on 9 p.m. It's a one and a half hour contest, so not a very long time. So if you have any, if you have college or if you have you know if you are uh, if you are doing office, right? You can easily log out from work and you know, like attend this contest, right? So it is going to be from 9 p.m. to 10:30 p.m. I say it's going to be a one and a half hour contest. There will be three programming questions. Right, as I said, uh, there will be three coding problems only on graphs, and don't worry, it will only be on topics that I have taught. If you go to my playlist thoroughly, right, you would be able to solve this question. As I said, there will be winners. There will be top five, uh, a top five uh, performers of this contest will have some surprise gifts on my side, right? So definitely go and register for this contest. The contest is on 9 to 11, 30, 9 to 10:30 p.m. on 24th of May, Tuesday. That is next week. So it is on, on, only going to be on drafts, right? And uh, again, and as I said, uh, there will be some rewards. The first five participants, uh, the top five participants will, uh, top five participants will get something from my side. And I am not revealing it right now, okay? And also you will get some Code Studio points, right? Uh, as you can see on the screen. Now, since Coding Ninjas agreed to do this. Uh, like and help me help me in my endeavor to help you guys in the uh, on the in the process. So let's go to their Code Studio platform, right? Which is also a very very good platform, by the way. It's been an awesome platform. I've also used it a lot. So over here, the you can see that there are in the interview prep section there are interview experiences of multiple companies. Like you can see uh, someone getting into Amazon, SD One Pressure. They have shared the experiences. Uh, someone getting into Microsoft has shared the experiences. You can go and click it. And you can view the interview process, right? And you can also try these problems, right? So this is a great experience. You can go and actually try out the problems that were actually asked in interviews. There is also a section of interview problems, and you can you will find a lot of company tag problems. Also, you will find in terms of you know topic wise, you can select various topics like dynamic programming, and you will get only on topics on uh, dynamic programming, which is very good by the way. Also, you can solve, uh, you can uh, apply the tags of the company, and you can solve from here as well. So that's also a pretty good thing that you can uh, get. Uh, uh, in this course studio, which is something that you won't get on a platform like Leetcode unless and until you're a premium user, right? If you're not a premium user in Leetcode, you won't be able to solve com problems tag by side. So again, there are many websites, but Code Studio is one of the premium websites that are there where you can actually solve company tag problems. They are adding more and more problems. The team is doing an awesome job, right? And also you can solve problems topic wise. So not only do you say, apart from that, they also have a lot of content, lot of content on other topics as well, agency preparation guides and TCS. Hack within fee right? Amazon is obviously there. Then you have web technologies, programming fundamentals. You have got system design. Uh, you have competitive programming and a lot of good things. So I would highly recommend you after giving the contest, right? Go and check out this platform, Code Studio, because I think it will really, really help you a lot. Uh, especially the, my favorite part is the company tag problems you can solve. Let's say when you are a, when you have an interview scheduled with a particular company, you can like. Just pick the company and solve those relevant problems that really, really will help in your preparation, especially when you have an interview lined up for a particular company, right? So do go and check this Code Studio and don't forget to register for this graph contest. I have specially handpicked the questions. So uh, I'm very sure this is going to be a great learning experience and a practice opportunity for you guys. And don't worry, I will discuss the solutions if you are unable to you know, solve or have some problems. I, I would be there for you, don't worry. But first, go and register for the contest and do give the contest. I will eagerly waiting for your participation, right? Because all the hard work that I put into this graph reading series, I'm very sure that is going to now be a little bit of benefits for you guys. When you guys will be able to solve those problems and even when you guys will come up to me and say, hey, your graph playlist actually helped us to solve, problem, solve these problems, it will really mean a lot to me. And most importantly, it will like serve as a kind of a mock coding contest or uh, it will prepare you for the interviews, right? Because as I said in the in the video straight away, that draft is a very, very important topic asked in major product based companies. So yeah, do go and register. I will attach the link in the description down below. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Don't forget to press the like button. Don't forget to press the bell icon so that every time I upload a new video, you get notified. Don't forget to follow my Instagram. Don't forget to join my Telegram group. I will attach all the links in the description. Don't forget to check out Code Studio, guys. And don't forget to register for the context. That is a must. I will put the link in the description to this contest. And with that, I will bid you goodbye. And all the very best for the contest. Goodbye.